Look at that. Crap. That bin has um, corning on it. That's my hometown. So what's really cool, these trees are producing about 40 to 50 pounds a piece. So every tree we've got is an entire lug box, one of these boxes here. We have calculated a 500 ml bottle takes about 14 pounds of olives. So this tree, if there were bottles of olive oils hanging off of this, 500 mLs, you probably have four to five bottles of olive oil on this tree. <laughs> Whoa. B. Yeah, this tree is absolutely loaded. I mean, look at the amount of fruit on that. You just want to pick them off, it looks so good and eat them, like grapes. As an olive matures, it gets reddish to purple and dark, and some people say black. Um, it's just a really dark purple. And the oil ton content goes up as the, the olive matures. So it's this balance of flavor and oil content that you really want to try and optimize. And that's really tough as a farmer and as a harvester a uh, producer like myself coming in and trying to time it just right. But this, if all the trees look like this, it'd be perfect. Yeah, this, if we could have every single lug box look like this with the color that we're getting in here, these olives are more mature than this green one here. So the oil content in this olive is gonna be much higher than in this green olive. The flavor profile though is the biggest difference where this is gonna start to be much more fruity like our Escalano has uh, peaches and apricots, those type of fruit flavors. This uh, green olive is going to be much more green in flavor, so have more uh, grass and like leaf, um, hay type flavors. The two, when you merge them together and make olive oil, that's when you can make really amazing, complex, extra virgin olive oil that has the fruit flavors, but also that greenness behind it. And um, that also then includes the high polyphenols because the polyphenol content in this green olive is going to be much higher than in this olive. Um, just the flavor profile of this is gonna be more close to what we want. So we always want a good mix of the maturity of olives. That's why I say this is perfect. It's amazing. <laughs> 